It is World Vegetarian Day today. We'll be talking about that. Don't all <laughs> scream I'm now. Sure I've already Jeannie. messed up. And <laughs> yeah. it's only 6.30. <laughs> I know, there's chicken on my desk as we speak. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back right after this brief timeout. Today is World Vegetarian Day, which kicks off World Vegetarian Month. And joining us this morning is Mark Ferguson, CEO of Down to Earth, an all-vegetarian store. Good morning. Thanks for being with us. Yeah, hi, Kathy. Thanks what, for having me. Sure. What's the significance of having a, a World Vegetarian Day? Uh, it's a day where people can learn more about adopting a vegetarian diet and the benefits of it. It's become much more popular in the last, we were saying, 10, 15 years yeah. because of the environmental awareness aspect of it. Right. Explain that part. Uh, well, being vegetarian is the, the single most important thing a person can do to improve the environment. In and really, different, <laughs> the different ways that it comes from is it um, uses a lot less natural resources mm -hmm. and also it h helps reduce global warming because uh, one of the biggest uh, uh, causes of global warming is actually all the methane gas from all the uh, animals that are being mm. raised to be eaten, like all the cows and the sheep and everything. They're like creating, you know, tons of manure. They're belching mm -hmm. lots. And this is actually the United Nations in their uh, 2006 report actually identified this as one of the most Im biggest causes of mm. greenhouse gases. And you know a lot about it because back home in Australia, you said your uncles had cattle ranches right, and so forth, yeah. and you bucked the trend, <laughs> so to speak, as a teenager, right. deciding to turn vegetarian. Yeah. That took some bravery in that family of yeah. yours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was a pretty controversial decision, yeah. <laughs> and you have been ever since. Yeah, 35 years now. How do you keep a balanced diet as a vegetarian? Uh, it's actually very easy. Uh, you just eat different kinds of fruits, vegetables, nuts, grains. Um, so it's, it's actually very simple. It's not as difficult as no, you might think. No. Down to earth, you're having something special today for the World Vegetarian Yeah, day. from 10 o'clock to 2 o'clock, we've got uh, lots of free samples and food demonstrations for and information about how to adopt a vegetarian diet. And didn't you just have uh, some renovations there? Yeah, we've just uh, newly remodeled our King Street store. It uh, looks really nice. Great. Um, and I love your deli area, by the way. Oh, you thank have you. Great selections. Yeah, we improved that a lot in the remodel. Now, do you think we'll be seeing more um, uh, all vegetarian or vegetarian only stores such as yours? or Because you're, you're one of a kind, actually. Right. Yeah, we're pretty unique, actually. In fact, we're, we're probably the largest all vegetarian company or retailer in the United States. But um, I think we'll see more and more uh, stores with more vegetarian options. I'm not sure how many all vegetarian stores we'll see, but hopefully we'll see more. Well, you've been around for a while, and we commend yeah. you for that, especially uh, especially these days, too. So hang in there with that, and uh, we'll see you on World Vegetarian Day with yeah. all the, from 10 to 2. Yeah. Thank you so much okay. for being with us. Thanks, Kathy.